we have at this point located a recording that the suspect in this incident made. It is about a 25 minute recording where he talks about what he has done. I would classify this as a confession. Uh, this was on a phone that we found in his possession early this morning uh, after we had the officer involved in shooting after he detonated that bomb that he had with him. On this recording, the suspect describes the six bombs that he constructed with a level of specificity that he identified the differences among those six bombs. We have told you all along that they all had similarities, which they did as far as specific components, but there were also differences between them. And on this recording, he identified what those differences were. I know everybody is interested in a motive and understanding why, and we are never going to be able to put a ration behind these acts. But what I can tell you, having listened to that recording, he does not at all mention anything about terrorism, nor does he mention anything about hate. But instead, it is the outcry of a very uh, challenged young man talking about challenges in his personal life that led him to this point. We still want our community to remain vigilant, as we always should, given the day and time in which we live now. But I also want to let the community know that he described seven explosive devices, and we have identified and, and, and are no longer in play those seven devices.